Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another video. So yesterday I received a package in the mail from fellow YouTuber and good friend of mine, Larkin's Lair. This is an upgrade set to transform the Generation Selects G2 Megatron into a more G2 looking G2 Megatron. But before we get started, if you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously and help me reach my goal of 10,000 subscribers by TFCon in October. So let's go ahead and get this opened up. Just peel that little sticker off. Open the box and we've got two baggies of parts. Baggy one and baggy two. This looks like to be the main cannon. And right here, there's a black pistol. And I guess those are the filler parts. So let's go ahead and get the cannon open first. Take a look at this. He did say there is some assembly required. So you got the big main piece here, the barrel. That looks like the attachment point. And what's this? Oh, that's the barrel tip. So let's go ahead and get this together. Let's see. This looks like the rougher end right here. So let's plug that in the tip of the barrel like so. And then let's see. He's got a little notch right there. If you can see if it'll focus in, there's a little notch right there. It looks like a lineup here so slide that in man that's that's a big barrel that looks awesome so now let's see this i believe goes on his back so let's okay we snap this slides together it's got two little pegs right here that'll match up to the little notches and slots there let's get that slid in locked in place so it can move, that's really cool. And I like how he added the little ratchet. So it's got a little soft ratchet to it. That's pretty sweet. So I've already got an upgrade attachment for my G2 Megatron, but it utilizes the cannon he came with. This looks much more like the original figure. So, oops, knock the camera there. Let's go ahead and get this off and attach this so you got this peg right here that's going to line up with that hole right there above his shoulder or behind his shoulder oh my god that looks awesome joel that looks amazing and it can move up and down that is too sweet i love it so let's see what's in box number two or package number two here We've got, move out of the way here, Megatron. All right, we've got his handgun because the G2 Megatron actually had a handgun. So, and here is, oh, there's the sensor array. Let's see, I bet that goes, yep, there's a hole right there to put the sensor array. <laughs> I love this. This looks awesome. Let me go ahead. Well, let's see. Oh, these are the arm filler sections. We got purple, green, and gray. Let me see. I guess I'm going to stick with green. Move this stuff out of the way. Let's go ahead and remove his shield. Oh no, I may keep that. I like the looks of that. But I will remove his little G1 self. I had G2 Megatron wielding G1 Megatron. It will give him his Larger rifle. Awesome. And let's see, here's the filler pieces. I guess these peg in like that, maybe. Oh, yeah. Slid right in. Let's see if I can get this one in too. 
And now we have Generation Select's G2 Megatron looking exactly like the original giant G2 Megatron figure. Joel, you knocked it out of the park with this set. This looks amazing. So let me bring in the big guy. Let's see, move him out of the way, and I'm going to have to adjust this camera accordingly. So there we go. Check this out. That looks awesome. I love it. The original G2 Megatron is one of my favorite Transformer toys, and I am blown away by how good this looks. Now let's check him out in tank mode. Now to utilize Larkin's set with Megatron's tank mode, you need to totally leave out this piece right here and his original cannon. What you're gonna do is take his new cannon and you've got the pegs here on either side that are gonna go right where the original cannon went. So just plug these into this section here and then just bring these two halves of the turret together and there you go now we got his big black gun and let's see i guess it can go oh he's got a hole right here on top and then you have the sensor array right here that you can just plug into this port right there on the side and there you have g2 megatron's tank mode and it's so cool i love the articulation i am really amazed how good this turret looks. It looks exactly like the G2 version. Though it kind of shortens the look of the tank a little bit. He looks more World War II-ish, but still, that's pretty cool. Now let's bring in the OG to compare him to. So now we have the Generation Selects upgraded version with the G2 original and I love it. I think they look great together. I do need to get some green paint so I can add a little green stripe on the barrel there. But this looks great. I like the sensor array, mounting the gun on top. Of course, there's the G2 Megatron's gun right there. That looks fantastic. I couldn't be happier with this set. Once again, another big shout out to Joel from Larkin's Lair for hooking me up with this upgrade set. It looks amazing. And as you can see, it's also Blast Effect compatible. Now I know Joel is selling these on his Etsy page and his first run has sold out, but I'm gonna put a link to that page in the description of this video. So when he does restock, you can get the chance to own one of these fantastic sets as well. Now guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. And big shout out to all my current subscribers that are helping me reach my goal of 10,000 subscribers by TFCon in October. Once again, guys, this is Patriot Prime, signing out. Hooah!